If you're any good at guessing, guess where these children are and what they're doing. If you want any clues, look at the happy faces all round. Notice the pencil in one girl's hand. The answer is, they're at school, having a lesson. The new term has begun at Summerhill, the most amazing school in the world, run by a headmaster that nobody calls Sir. To the pupils, he's just plain Neil. To the outside world, he's Mr. A.S. Neil, educational pioneer. If his pupils don't want to go to lessons, they just stay away. If when they get there, they're bored, they do anything they like. How do the teachers teach when it isn't compulsory to pay attention? It's up to them to make the subject interesting. Otherwise, the pupils might vote to chuck them out for being dull. The children make their own rules at a weekly parliament where they decide such things. Sometimes they'll even vote for lessons when the teachers want a holiday. Other times they'll decide to pack up books for the day and have a dance. If someone suggests, let's ask Neil, he's allowed to come too. Neil doesn't force his pupils to do anything. They needn't wash, they do when the novelty of going grubby is worn off. When a problem child comes along who steals or lies, he's never punished for it. And Neil says that cures him. According to him, children are made into problems by their parents. It's the father and mother who should be spanked. There's no beating at Summerhill, except for the beatings up that the children give each other sometimes in fun. Does it work, this new idea in schooling? According to Neil, it does. And if, as he says, a happy child is a good child, there must be a lot of good in Summerhill. <laughs>